is proof that you can break into tech from literally any other job. This data is from the World Economic Forum Future of Jobs report, and what it's showing is the percent of people in blue who went into their current job from a similar kind of job versus in green, the percent of people who went into that job from a completely different kind of job. And if you look at the second row here, the one that says data and AI, you can see that only 28% of people get data jobs from other data jobs. 72% of people in data jobs go into data from a completely different kind of job. I'm one of them. I used to do academic research in the biomedical field. One of the reasons the number of people switching into data jobs is so high is because data analytics is literally the number one job with the most increasing demand, tied with data science which is in this same report. So you can see number one in increasing demand, data analysts and scientists. So data analytics is a hugely growing field, meaning there's tons of job openings, even at entry level. And that's why so many people are able to transition in from other kinds of jobs. There aren't as many data analysts as there are jobs for data analysts which is one of many reasons why you don't need previous job experience in data analytics to get a data analytics job. You just need to teach yourself how to do data analytics, which you can do online for free. If you want to do that, check out my free course. It's in my profile, or you can Google Charlotte Chase free course. It includes all my recommendations for where to go online to learn data analytics for free, plus my opinion on the order you should do it in, my resume template that you can edit, and even some LinkedIn tips. Get started now if you want to be one of the 72% of people in a data job that pivoted from a completely different kind of job.